American film producer, actor, voice actor, as well as musician, Jeffrey Leon, Jeff Bridges, was born on the 4th of December, 1949, in Los Angeles, California, of part British ancestry through his mother. His first appearances were in the 1958 television adventure series, Sea Hunt, in which he co-starred alongside his father, Lloyd Bridges, and his brother, Bo Bridges. So, just how rich is Jeff Bridges as of late 2017? According to Celebrity.Money, Bridges' net worth is estimated to be over $80 million, most of which he accumulated from his various involvements in the entertainment industry, which began in the late 1950s. Sea Hunt was a hugely popular show with viewers and maintained the number one spot in the ratings throughout the nine months from its debut on television screens. It is estimated that 40 million viewers per week watched the show, but despite favorable reviews and impressive ratings, it was taken off the air after four seasons and 155 episodes. However, Jeff didn't neglect his education, studying at University High School, and upon matriculation, moved to New York, where he enrolled into the Herbert Berghoff Studio, following which he he became a member of the United States Coast Guard Reserve. When he returned from reserve commitments, Bridges devoted himself fully to acting and made his first adult on-screen appearance in the drama film entitled The Company She Keeps. He then made appearances in his father's drama series called The Lloyd Bridges Show, which certainly helped Jeff to launch a career as an actor. He followed up with such films as The Last Picture Show with Timothy Bonhams, a science fiction film called Tron and Tron Legacy, in which he co-starred alongside David Warner, Garrett Hudlin, and Olivia Wilde, and The Fisher King, directed by Terry Gilliam, in which the main characters were portrayed by Robin Williams and Amanda Plummer. Perhaps one of Bridges' most notable appearances was in the crime comedy film called The Big Lebowski, in which he played the role of Jeffrey the Dude Lebowski. Even though the film was initially considered to be a box office failure, it gained a cult following over the years and eventually became a cult classic. It inspired the beginning of the Lebowski Fest, an annual gathering in Kentucky, which celebrates the movie as well as the creation of Dudism, a philosophy inspired by the main character of the movie. Undoubtedly, The Big Lebowski was a huge influence on the viewers and the film industry in general. Uniquely, Jeff is still one of the youngest ever Academy Award nominees, age 22 for Best Supporting Actor in The Last Picture Show, and one of the oldest ever winners at age 60 for Best Actor in Crazy Heart, which also won him the Golden Globe for Best Actor in a Drama, and the Screen Actors Guild Award for Outstanding Performance by a Male Actor in a Leading Role. Jeff has now appeared in over 70 films and more than 20 TV productions. Even though Jeff Bridges is best known as an actor, he has also launched a singing career. Bridges debuted in the music industry with Be Here Soon, his debut studio album released in 2000. More recently, in 2011, after singing to Blue Note Records, Jeff released his second album, a self-titled studio work which debuted in the Billboard 200 chart top 40 and produced the hit single, What a Little Bit of Love Can Do. So, also adding somewhat to Jeff's wealth. In his personal life, Jeff Bridges has been married to Susan Geston since 1977, and they have three daughters. They still reside in Los Angeles. He is known as a strong supporter of the End Hunger Network, which, as the name suggests, aims at ending childhood hunger. He also supports the Amazon Conservation Team and other environmental causes. 